Hi, I'm Kimberly Trion, and I'm going to do oral med administration. I'm going to start by verifying the provider's orders. I'm going to verify the six rights of med administration, ensure I have the right patient, the right drug, dose, route, time, and documentation. Um, I'm going to pull up the patient's MAR, verify my medications against the order, uh, do any drug dosage calculations that I need to do. Today, the provider has ordered 100 milligrams of Colace um, PO, that's one tablet, five milligrams of Coumadin PO, one tablet, 20 milligrams of Lasix PO, one tablet, and uh, 20 milliequivalents of potassium chloride uh, PO, again, one tablet, as well as um, 500 milligrams in 15 mLs of acetaminophen, and that's a, a liquid suspension. Um, we're going to grab all of our stuff. We're going to enter our patient's room, close the door curtain for privacy, perform hand hygiene. Hi, sir. I'm Kim. I'm going to be your nurse today. Will you verify your full name and date of birth? Verify the patient with two patient identifiers. All right, Mr. Smith, um, before we start, can I ask, do you have any allergies to medications, food, or environmental? Okay. Uh, today, your doctor has ordered a couple medications, so we'll go over those in a minute, okay? Uh, we're going to do our hand hygiene, do our gloves. Uh, we're going to pull up our patient's chart in the room. We're going to do our third verification of our medication against our um, orders in our MAR. Um, because we are giving warfarin, I'm going to check that his INR is within the acceptable range uh, for that medication, as well as we're giving um, acetaminophen. So verify I have a current pain scale of 0 to 10, as well as a temperature. Um, ideally, I'd probably get a full set of vitals. Um, all right, Mr. Smith, um, for these medications, would you like them all in one cup or would you like to take them individual? Okay, we'll put them all in one cup for you. So we're going to start with the colace. The colace is a laxative. Um, it softens the stool to prevent constipation. Uh, some of the side effects of colace are nausea, vomiting, diarrhea. Um, some people get a bitter taste in their mouth. Some adverse effects of this one are going to be abdominal cramping or a rash. So let me know if you get any of those symptoms, okay? Do you have any questions on the colace? Okay. Um, next, we have our warfarin or, or coumadin. Um, this is a anticoagulant or blood thinner, and it's used to treat or prevent any blood clots. Um, some of the side effects of coumadin are going to be bleeding, uh, easy bruising, or joint or muscle pain. Uh, some of the more concerning side effects are going to be bright red stools or dark tarry stools, um, as well as any dizziness on standing. I need you to let me know immediately, okay? Do you have any questions on the Coumadin? Okay. The next one we have is Lasix or furosemide. Um, this is a loop diuretic. Um, some people call it a water pill. And this helps um, the edema or the swelling that some people get with congestive heart failure um, or kidney or liver disease. Um, some of the side effects of our Lasix are going to be urinary frequency as your body's kind of expelling that that fluid, uh, constipation, and some people have some blurred vision. Um, some of the more concerning side effects are gonna be chest pain, shortness of breath, uh, muscle cramps or weakness. I need you to let me know immediately, okay? All right, do you have any questions on the Lasix? All right, and then your final uh, tablet that we have is potassium chloride. This is 20 mil equivalents. Um, potassium chloride is a electrolyte. Uh, we often give this with the Lasix just to prevent low potassium levels. Some of the side effects of our potassium chloride is um, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, upset stomach. Um, our more concerning side effects for this one are going to be a irregular heartbeat, any tingling, um, or severe stomach pain. Let me know immediately, okay? Do you have any questions on the potassium? All right. And the final medication that we have is our acetaminophen or our Tylenol. Uh, this is a fever reducer and a pain reliever. So it's it treats um, pain and fever. 
Um, some of the side effects of this are going to be nausea, vomiting, uh, constipation. Um, our concerning side effects would be dark or decreased urine, um, any abnormal sweating or yellowing of the skin or eyes. Let me know immediately, okay? So this one, we have 500 milligrams and 15 milliliters. Your doctor has ordered the full 500 milligrams. So we're going to place our cap upright. We're going to make sure that there's no sediment. Hold our label. And we're going to measure on a flat surface. And we have our 15 milliliters. We're going to just wipe the lip and the neck just to make sure we don't have any drops. And recap it. All right, Mr. Smith, I'm going to assist you to a sitting position. Uh, here are your pills. Would you like some water or juice to help swallow those? Okay. And then here is your Tylenol. This is um, 15 mLs. I don't know if you can see that. Um, and then you can take some water or some juice after that to help get that one down. All right. So we are going to discard our trash. We can verify one last time um, our medications with the wrappers. Discard our gloves. We're going to do our hand hygiene. All right, Mr. Smith, I'm going to verify your bed is in a low and locked position. Uh, side rails are up if needed. Um, your colite is within reach. Do you need anything before I go? Okay, I'm going to go... Um, I'm going to come back and check on you in a little bit. I'm going to go document my procedure.